you know forex is the last thing that you're giving yourself and it's like your last hope because some of us that's where we were five years ago forex for me like i like let me just even say it loud was my last hope and i had reached a place where i told god like i'm trying this and if it doesn't work i don't know what to do with my life and if you're in that place where definitely like forex is the last thing that you're giving you all the energy like you have been frustrated so many times and you're telling yourself maybe there's a light in this forex i've been hearing about this video is for you i have made this video to tell you that you're in the right place and in the right moment and if only you can hear what i will say by the end of this video you will have something you like there will be energy people don't understand that when you watch someone online or when you watch some let's say when you just listen to someone talking there is an exchange of a spirit so for me i would want to exchange a very positive spirit to you as you watch me number one and number two i want to show you that you're not alone and it is normal to feel what you're feeling sometimes we may think oh maybe i'm not normal because i am feeling frustrated i'm feeling disappointed i have been like i have failed so many times and at the end of the day you're like what will i do with my life so if you are feeling that way I, I want to tell you something that can help you go through remember what the bible says that even if you walk through the waters i will be with you even you if you walk through the rivers you'll not be overwhelmed if you if you walk through the fire you shall not be burned what that word is telling you even if you walk meaning there are times that in your life you will pass through fire and the word is promising us that you won't be burned and for me i feel like the reason why everything is not working so that you can have a very clear a uh, clear mindset and you focus on forex because have you ever noticed that those people who do forex they have the similar majority of us who do forex have like similar stories either you 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 were fired at work or you quit your job or you have been looking for job for many years or you're a stay home mom or you don't have some job like those people who come to the forex industry majority of us we are you see the way it's like our last hope and it's not bad because remember this industry it is tough and it wants someone who has been in a tough environment for people who are working and they try to do forex it may not work for them because already they're in a comfort zone of their job and if at all maybe and i get this a lot many people tell me i have been doing forex for five years ten years two years and it is not working for me and the first thing i ask them is do you do forex like fully or is it part-time and they tell me 99 percent tell me it's part-time let me tell you when you come to forex trading and you're doing it part-time maybe you're employed and you're doing it part-time it may take longer because you're in your comfort zone so one this video it will help you to make that decision if you need to go and quit that job that is stressing you up you know yourself yes i am talking to you there is a job that has been stressing you up either there is a rejection in your workplace or there is a mistreatment in your workplace or they are not paying you how much you are worth and the only reason you are holding on that job is because you are holding on the job because it is giving you comfort so when you come to forex maybe it is the channel that god wants to finally bless you he is limited because there's something that is um competing your attention so me doing this video i want you to have a clarity that finally i have made this decision 
and forex has to work for me regardless of i know the market i am a beginner i don't have capital i don't have a background of education like regardless and and if you're watching me and you have gone to another country you're not in your own country let's say you went to another country to look for job and in that country you're being frustrated again this video is for you because if you master forex trading you can now make a decision to go back to your country and have the freedom that you are looking for because when you went outside of your country you, you went to look for freedom for finances breakthrough and I, I i was to do this video yesterday and i kept saying imagine forex when it is your last hope what are you supposed to do and i will give you three things when you know for sure this video is not for people with options this is not the video for people with um five businesses because it will never make sense for them at the end of the day they will do forex trading as um as a side hustle if you hear someone saying i am doing forex as a side hustle they still have a long journey to make and i'll give you the story of isaiah uh in in the book of isaiah chapter 6 go read isaiah chapter 6 the bible says that when king uziah died i saw the lord so there's something that has to die in your life in you um it it may people are different there's something that has to die for you to start seeing breakthrough so it's either doubt has to die completely or fear has to die or ego has to die or just feeling sorry for yourself has to die something has to come out of your life so that it can give a space for god to be able to help you so that even if you watch my videos here on youtube either you understand or you're able to apply whatever i am saying so you have to come to a terms of what have i been uplifting that is interfering when i come to trade forex because if you come to trade forex when you don't have clarity of mind you will always feel like a failure when you don't know how to deal with a loss in in the market it's something that you are carrying in you may be an ego if you don't you're not able to execute the trades let's say you have analyzed the market but you fail to execute you are dealing with the spirit of fear if at all you enter the market and you keep pushing the market to give you more money maybe you're dealing with the spirit of greed and it's high time that thing has to die for you now to be free for god to use you and to help you understand everything about forex trading so i am speaking again i'm speaking for those people forex is their last hope like this is the this is the last thing this is the last thing that you are tempting and i have seen when you when it's your last thing even when you will listen to stories when people start their companies they say this was the last money that i invested in this business and that business picks up because now your brain knows that you have nowhere you don't have any source of income so it has to happen so the first thing i want you to go identify what has been pulling you apart because trust me you have that thing that has been pulling you apart maybe it's family members maybe it's a decision of your let's say your parent wanted you to do nursing or doctor or lawyer and you you feel in your heart this is not what i want to learn in school maybe you are watching me you're in a university you're in college you're doing a course and you know deep down in you that's not what you want you have to make that tough decision you won't be the first person to drop out and i'm not telling people i'm not doing this video to encourage people to drop to drop out of school i'm just telling you even if you choose the bible says that we may make we may have so many plans we may choose so many plans but the plan of God is the only plan that will prevail. So you may have your own calendar, but God has his own calendar concerning your life. So you have to first realize, by the way, what is this that has been preventing me to make it in Forex? What is this that has to die? And that's what Isaiah did. When Uzziah left and died, that's when uh, prophet Isaiah was able to see the Lord. Okay, So um, just just do a research just do a research okay. know what is this that is in my life that is preventing me to succeed in forex whatever it is 
what is that that is limiting you? Because let me tell you, people are different. There is what is limiting you. For me, let me tell you what was limiting me to do forex reading for a very long time. For me, I convinced my brain that I can never understand forex, that my husband has to learn and then he teaches me. For me, I convinced myself that this is some, it's a field for men. It's not a field for women. For me, I, I believe that what even am I doing? I knew trading Forex. I needed millions of Kenya shillings or $10,000 to even put capital. Like I was so ignorant to understand the real ideal of starting Forex trading. So for me, I knew that was what was limiting me. So when I removed all that and I removed all the doubt and I removed wanting to be perfect, and I removed crazy ideas that I, it takes a lot of time, it has pay, I will lose money and I feel bad. And when I removed all that, that's when I saw the growth. So this, the second thing that I want you to do is to stop being in the needing point and start living in the, uh, in the, in the reality that already you are a successful trader. Many people who text me, they tell me, I want to be successful trader. I want to make money. I want to be profitable. I've been losing. What you are not, what you don't realize is that when you tell your mind that you want something, you are not in need, it makes it complicated because you will never reach to have it. So you have to convince your mind. Remember, we have two types of mind. We have subconscious mind and you have the conscious mind. We have the physical mind and we have the high mind. You have to convince and start working with your high mind. Your high mind knows I am capable. I, am, I have everything that I want. And it's not being created. It's already created. The house I want, it is there. The money I want, it is there. The car I want, it is there. It's just me to wake up, to do what I'm supposed to do to reach these things. So I want you to change the state of your mind. You change the language, the how you speak. Because again, if Forex is the only thing that is left for you, you have now to take control of your life. And that is a whole topic and I feel I can make a new video about it because it's a whole topic. It's called the power of mindset and you stop living in the need and you start living like you have. The Bible says from Psalms 23 that my Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. So many people live in the want rather than living they have it. The Bible says that I, the Lord, gives you the power to make wealth. And I will do exceedingly, abundantly, above all you think or imagine. God is telling us he will do abundantly what we think or imagine so thinking and imagination it is very very great even in the in the god system in the kingdom of god thinking and imagining is very very big so what you think with your mind what you imagine and then the bible says what you think or imagine through the power that is in you so everything like you have everything guys you have everything so that is the second thing that you need to watch out on your thoughts and what you think think yourself as a successful trader think you think like you have already made it uh, just have a very good thought and imagination okay and the third thing i will always tell you to pray Pray, pray, pray a lot. Pray. The Bible says if you feel afflicted, pray. Anytime like you feel like things are not working around you, just pray. Because the Bible says that you may not control what is outside, but you can control what is inside. You don't need to be happy because of the things that are outside. The Bible says that in the presence of the Lord, there is joy. So when you hear about God and when you pray, there is joy. Joy does not come because outside things are making you happy. But the joy of the Lord comes even if you are hurt, even if you are wounded, even if your heart broken. There is still the joy of the Lord. Like you know, God is still seated on the throne and he cannot leave you. He cannot forsake you. So I have told you, if Forex is your last thing. If Forex is what you're saying, this one, this one, I have to make it. It's either I make it or make it. Take those notes and make sure you have listened to this video at least two or three times bye bye love you